Hey, basket makers. How you doing? Ooh, what's going on, y'all? Okay, let's see. Okay, there we go. Hey, y'all. Hey, how you doing? Okay, y'all. This is video number three. I'm trying to get out what I can. Uh, get it out, get it out, get it out. Okay? Okay. So, today, or this next video, because today, we've been working today, y'all. Um, woke up feeling good. First of all, thankful, right? Because one, if you wake up on this side, baby, be thankful. Because it didn't have to wake you up. So, I'm thankful and grateful for every day he blessed me with on this side. So, been feeling good, so I'm trying to get stuff accomplished. And like I say, I once I got the idea together or the concept or I stopped going back and forth, back and forth, I can move. I can get some baskets done, you know, especially once I stage my first one, the, the next, you know. That's why I like my big table in the dining room because it is spacious and I can do what I need to do. So, I know y'all didn't say, girl, you, that's extra. We ain't asked for all that. So, let's get to the video. All right. So, this video, y'all, is going to be the pajama bottom pants, okay? So, I'm doing some in pink because I have a majority of these pink PJs uh, bottoms that I got for a dollar last year. I don't even remember when I got them, but I know they had been last year, right? So what I do is I'm going to open these because y'all know I like to roll and get my a bigger uh, girth so it helps fill. I cut this off. I'm going to cut off the size and I'm going to tape it on the side so that way when they're selling it, is uh, they know exactly what size the customer needs. So let's get that taken care of first because size matter. Okay, so that's what I do. And it's inside the bag, so can't nobody pull them off. Like, you know how kids and stuff be on the card and stuff. Can't nobody pull it out because I keep it inside. We're going to take that label off. I'm on the hunt. I need one, two, three more of these, y'all. And really, I need, yeah, three. Because what I'm going to do on these other ones is um, I'm going to show you. I show you that at the end, so let's get crack a lack it. All right, let's fill it first. I guess I should have did that because I know this noise from this paper be getting on some people nerves. But I think I have three, four to fill that. So it took four of my shipping papers that I get from U-Haul. Um, and I'm going to, as much as I need pink, and I do, I do not have any more pink tissue. But I am determined to not be, get these dropped today. So it's okay for this one to just have a wiping because this is why. So, plus, I don't have to use my hated shred. Y'all know I hate that crinkle cut shred. Oh, who it do something to my soul, y'all? It do. I know it shouldn't, but it do. Oh, I hate that shred. But uh, my friend, she was just, oh, but you I love it. I said, girl, I hate it. This one, I, I love this. And I be pulling the strings like this is the crinkle cut. I do got some over here to me. And I just pull them trying to, you know, make them better. I don't know. Jesus, I don't know what it is. It just irked my soul. But okay. So let's get this. And I haven't had time, y'all, to go in and read any comments when I actually, this is going to be my last gift for the day that I know of. And then I'm going to 
set it down. I'm gonna take one of my roll boxes and I'm just gonna, you know, so all I do is make a little roll and I take one side down and then just take the other side and then I'm gonna roll the PJs on top. Now these, this is just fake, uh, that little bow part. You don't need that. And I already put the size on there. Let me break this nail off because it keeps catching. And I don't want to mess nobody's stuff up. So. And I tuck in the, like the little crotch part. I stuck it in. So there we go. And all I'm going to do, y'all, all I'm doing is laying it on the back. Okay, there we go. Just like that. That's how the back look. Now, this time, at Valentine, I did two pieces. This time, I'm only doing one body wash. Oh, here it goes. All right, y'all. I'm doing one body wash. I'm going to do champagne toast. See how nice that go with that? And I'm going to put it right here. Right here. And I'm going to go ahead and lock this down because the weight of the body wash pushed the PJs forward. So, let me get it so it's standing and it's not moving nowhere. So, that's how it's going to look, y'all. All right. And I'm going to put an oversized sponge. Now, this is the trick. And it's not a trick in a bad way, but this is a trick to help you to make something look full, especially when you're not using a whole bunch of small items. Whereas Dollar Tree, you can get a pink sponge, of course, two for a dollar. And I'm going to show you the size. So you know how some people be saying size don't matter? Size do matter. It do matter. According on what we're talking about, it always matters. Okay, just make sure size appropriate is what we want to do. So this is the two for a dollar one. This is the dollar one, right? Or two for a dollar twenty five. And this is the dollar one, period, in that six pack that I get from Burlington, right? See how nice and full that is? You see how the size comparison? Right. So I use this with small gifts or inexpensive gifts. These I like when I'm helping trying to fill uh, gaps most definitely in big gifts. So you see now how how full they just made that section. I don't have to do nothing else. And really, I need to scoot this over some because this is pushing off, right? So I'm going to shift it over a little more. So that way, it can fit in there. Okay, so that's like that. I'm going to put that sponge right there. See how nice and full that sponge is? And we're going to go ahead and lock that down. Again, this is something new. Usually, I put two pieces with it. But I'm trying to um, give a little something cheaper. Now, we're going to put a flower with it. And with my PJ bottoms, I always put... Oh man, a pair of socks. Now you could do the socks two different ways. I usually have it right there, remember, tucked to the side, and this can go here. See how that is? Or on this last one, my hand keep uh, my nail keep up catching so I can do it like this which is how I did it on another one which is going across it would have been it needs to be behind here and so both pairs of you know and you kind of counter quarter cat a corner good lord okay I need me an English teacher over here but I did it like this, which is across the back. And I'm going to lift it up, y'all, so you can see how it look on the top. Right? Right there. 
So you're gonna see just the edge right there. But yeah, you can layer it like I just did and give you two lengths, the cover on the back. And then what's gonna go there is this pastel pink and I'm twirling it on my finger. And I'm gonna sit that right there. There you go. See how that is? Just that easy, y'all. Now, I'm gonna give you options. Cause we always like options. We always like the opportunity to do it some uh, different if we wanna do it different. Another idea I thought about was if I use just one piece, what if I had used the lotion, right? Lotion is good for putting on your feet and you could have did a foot file. What do I mean about a foot file? Well, one of these, like these little pedicure kids, they brought them out in the pastel pinks, baby. Pastel pinks. I could have did that like that and that would have put one more piece in there with that lotion, the sponge and the flower and the socks. And you could have did that as well. See? We got options over here. Okay. And the other thing you could do, like you're going to see my night shirts again. I showed you many times. I do them at every holiday. But the night shirt, I could have put the shower gel and the sponge also with the night shirt. Because I wouldn't have a sponge with just the lotion. Mm -mm. It don't make sense. You don't need a sponge with just a lotion. But you do need a sponge with a shower gel. But if I had did just this and this, I would have put a pedicure set right here. Something that can tie in with the socks and the feet. So then it all, again, see how it's all working? Socks, lotion, pedicure set, your night pants, get it together. It's all self-care, okay? But these are just options, okay? I'm doing the shower gel because guess what? This was the only thing that I had in this pastel pink, this champagne toast. And all I had was six of these. And I think I needed eight, but my girlfriend, she had two. So I got two from her today. So we switched out some uh, product. She wanted some something and uh, some thousand wishes. And I needed some champagne toast to finish up the rest of these. So I'm going to show you the other ones. So that way you'll see. So this is it. This is all. Okay. I just wanted to show that to you. And then I'm going to bag them up off that. Now I had to do the blue because I had two pair of blue. Remember I say this thing is heavy. So that's really what I needed to lock down. I don't know why I locked down the sponge first. But again, I did that. I didn't have no socks. So that's what you don't see. So I'm going to add some white socks to that. Um, I did the beautiful day. And remember how I told y'all about pricing? Just because you go somewhere, you have to you need to still stay with the regular price. And this is the reason why. For me to complete this concept, I had to go do the buy three, get three, because every time I went to the outlet, they did not have anything in this color on the two dollar and three dollar table. So I had to do the buy three, get three. I needed six anyway, about six. And because I have some cream ones, like with a zebra pattern, and I'm going to put it in the same turquoise bucket. So it's going to be four with a like a blue concept, right? And I did that. I'm going to add my socks and all this good stuff in to the blues. And then <clears throat> I had only one pair of the hot pink stripe ones. And I did the Bahama passion fruit with that. Now these I got out at the outlet. It was $3 and I had a coupon. So I think $2.25 I believe I paid for. So you see what I'm talking about? Use that outlet as a filler in between your semi-annual to help build your stockpile as well. Okay. And you know, sometimes you just need. And, and also... Look, and, 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 and also, but uh, it's a great way to, um, all it is is repackaging, same product, same line, same scent. So you just getting last year packaging, 
versus this new this year packaging okay so that's all it is it's not like it's not good because they couldn't sell it if it wasn't good okay for those you know who interested but if you don't live in georgia and um check and see where the closest one to you see even out there at the outlet um it used to be victoria's secret outlet too but they closed that because they just weren't getting enough business out there i don't know if you in Myrtle Beach, y'all got a Victoria's Secret outlet up there. Okay, go check them out. Because I did when I was up there on, on my girl's trip. We we towed that store up, baby. We towed, <laughs> we shot like we didn't have no common sense. But, I, uh, yeah, they have everything in there. Okay, at Valentine's, y'all remember that little pop uh, perfume from Victoria's Secret? That's where I got it, Victoria's Secret outlet in Myrtle Beach. So, yeah, this was the other one. That's with the hot pink. You know, those hateful shreds that I hate. But, and then, of course, again, I'm going to show you one more time. This was the pastel pink with the champagne toast. It's one and done, y'all. We good. We done. And I will see you in the next one. That's it. That's all, y'all. Thank you again. I appreciate you. Uh, let me know down in the comments below if you have any questions and if you have an outlet near you okay bye-bye